What's up YouTube? Now, let's take a look at how to deploy DMVPN Duo Hub, Duo Cloud. Uh, compared to previous topology uh, where we had Duo Hub, Single Cloud, now, with this topology we can have uh, multiple hubs and different uh, clouds or tunnels, networks, okay? So, what we're going to deploy right now is we're going to make New York uh, hub and we have we'll make London as well a hub but for another uh, network okay uh, in terms of configuration it doesn't change much compared to what we saw before except for one key and or one argument and we're going to see this right now okay so let's start with New York let's First hub. Uh, uh, this is not new for you. At this point, uh, source from A0, tunnel uh, mode, theory mode point. Uh, my MHRP network is one. MHRP map multi tags is dynamic. Uh, We'll be using the phase three and we'll be using as well EHRP. So I have to disable split or right here. Okay. Split or right EHRP one. And we'll use this new parameter saying, okay, this tunnel will have this key. And it's going to make sense just in a moment. Uh, let's enable your JP 1150. And that should be enough. Uh, New York. And. Uh, London, not true. So in London, we have a different tunnel and a different network. Just to make things also clear, we can we could use the same uh, network ID. This is locally significant. It is not sent uh, between uh, the, the routers. But for just to make easy when it comes to troubleshooting, so just make it. Uh, easy for you to read. Um, so the tunnel, the AJP process, it can keep the same. They won't search the changes in any way. And my local network here is still. And I want to use the second object. Uh, not second object, but second IP address. Uh, that should be London. It's London. Yes. Uh, okay. Should be London. Okay. Not changed so far. Oh. Dublin. Spoke. So actually, we will have two tunnels. I want to take advantage of it's easier to replace. So Dublin is using third IP. It's the same, the same. Uh, NHS is 10.1.5.1. It's NBMA is 192.16.02. I'll take a shortcut. I don't need that and use the so the thing is from spoke perspective i'll be sourcing my traffic from the same interface so i have to tell look when i'm sourcing this from this interface use this key and when i'll be sourcing uh to this interface i mean for this tunnel 
use this key and use that use for tunnel two obviously as i'll be sourcing from the same interface okay what is going to make the distinction which interface to use is the key number okay so you will know okay key two refers to uh tunnel two so this way the uh, traffic uh, Descent to a specific tunnel will be sent to that tunnel. Okay, don't want to change this. Like you want to refer to uh, to another tunnel, but you're using a different key. Okay. Uh, let me see. Tunnel source, tunnel modes, NHRS. Okay. Tunnel two. Actually, third IP address. Network ID is the same. NHS going to be uh, 10, 1, 6, 2, NBMA uh, 192.16.0.2, oh, uh, and support multicast. That's what it was missing here. Support multicast. And uh, give me a shortcut. I don't need that. And uh, we good. And should be five and my local network is three. And okay. Nice. And I should see tunnel coming up and two ERJP neighbors ten one five one. And 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 come on. What about ten one six fifty ten one six three? Six two which one I use? Ten one six two. Ten one six two. Oh Yes, my bad. My bad. My bad. Oh, really? Ah, oh, man, just get worse. Okay, so and probably I should flap the tunnel. Oh, it was okay. Yeah. Okay. Now it's, now it's better. Should it be? And you, yeah, that's what I want to see. Now let's bring uh, Brussels to party. And uh, Brussels. Okay. Yep. So Brussels is using four and four. And you should see both tunnels up and two adjacencies yep that's good and i should have those networks as well okay so far so good now how does it change so how is the routing taking place so right now i'm using tunnel one and you can see that uh, I'm choosing uh, uh, Brussels uh, network over two tunnels. Um, but I could just use one of them. Uh, let me see. Yes. And I could just use one of them by adding. Uh, this would be tweaking ERJP. Like, 
setting the delay, uh, making one of them less preferred than other by doing this uh, sex with VPN. And I will say it's 100 and 1000. Uh, yeah. Oh, man, that's my head. Morning time one. Really? Oh, man, I'm terrible today. Uh, it's just uh, the record. Okay, so right now, should be using just channel one okay from pc3 no big deal okay still the same and uh dmvpn we can see that it we can trick uh however we want depending on our what are the requirements uh because right now we have two tunnels uh if we want we could make uh both hubs to be part of the same tunnel just to scale this in some way you can get real really crazy with this uh but and again just thing something to highlight is that the routing protocol that will be used you have to take that into account that because if you're using ospf it will behave a different way if you're using bgp it will behave a different way uh, it's, I'm just using EAGP because it's easier to process and you don't have to tweak much with EAGP when it comes to SPF and BGP there are some some curious and very interesting scenarios that you can fall into okay so that's it deploying DMVP and dual hub dual cloud I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one